This is a Siemens E310 communications receiver, uh, late 50s, early 60s, I think. Um, it's in for res refurbishment. There's uh, quite a few tired looking components in there and under the chassis. And uh, the band switches probably need a really good clean. They're a push button affair. Um, but it does work. Uh, you want to talk me it works, so let's give it a give it a try. Oh, one of the dial lights is on. The other one isn't. <laughs> oh, there we go. Broadcast band. The AGC on audio game. Limiters off. Two selectivity positions on AM and then one narrow one for CW. Beautiful pitch control, interpolation tuning. Tuning eyes dead. It's got a calibrator in it. Oh, interesting. Light comes on. Nice. Two speed tuning. Hey, for a free confidential consultation, call 800 343 6460. 800 343 6460. 800 343. British TV and So do the control works okay? Switch is a bit dirty. Seems to be dead on that one band there. It's, uh... 85 to 175 kilohertz. Could be just a switch. I need to, to check that out. Nothing seems to be untoward inside the uh, side of the set. What on earth is that? <laughs> well, there's a selenium rectifier and could be a fuse, I guess. I need to check it out. I haven't looked at the uh, the schematic or the manual. I think the manual's in German. I uh, couldn't find a, an English version of the manual when I was uh, checking through things a few nights ago. But uh, at least it's working. <laughs> and, uh, it's a He's already lost this case uh, because it's a Judge Aileen Cannon uh, ruled There we go. Um, Siemens E310. A switch on on the bench. I think I'll be giving it a good clean to start with and then uh, start checking the components, changing a few capacitors and checking resistors and then giving the switches a good clean. We'll see where it goes from there.